Red Dead Online is seemingly dying a very slow, painful, yet purposeful death and I'm pretty sure Rockstar knows exactly what they're doing. No matter what, when it comes to Red Dead Online, it's always two steps forward and 10 steps back. As we look at the new naturalist role, it seems like we were gonna have fun and it seems like finally an update came to online, something to do, but we were terribly wrong. And the fact that now a new patch broke the naturalist update, I just have my hands in my face and I'm asking why? Why are you actively trying to kill Red Dead Online? I have this conversation a lot with people about Red Dead Online, and the biggest problem with Red Dead Online is that it has so much potential and not enough game. The thing I talk about a lot is that the game should just write itself for things you want to do. You have cowboys in the Wild West, and you want to be cowboys. But Red Dead Online really doesn't do that. They might as well give you actual handcuffs to put on your character because you're so held back. We're a cowboy that can't rob people. You can't rob a citizen, you can't rob a bank, and you damn sure cannot go into a town and rob their bank and or any of their stores because who knows, maybe it'll break the economy, but secretly it's just because they really don't want you to have fun. I think the biggest problem now with Red Dead Online is that we keep looking for the updates to add different roles to the game, but the roles is actually what's completely holding this game back. No more is the freedom of doing open world things. You now have to go from town to town looking at the stupid bounty boards or checking your daily logins to see how many alligator teeth you can skin and sell them for point to gold. Rather than being able to go out into the world and experience the game through dynamic events or let the player choose what they want to do, they feel so pigeonholed in what they have to do. The way we get things like guns is fine, but Ultimately, when I play, I wanna be able to have more fun than what I'm doing. It seems like I can play Red Dead for two hours and accomplish like two things and, and never feel like I actually did anything. We have a posse system that doesn't do anything. Yeah, you can posse up with other people, but why? You already know if people are in a posse, you're gonna get griefed to oblivion. And thinking about this new naturalist role, I have to ask the question, why the hell is it here in the first place? I can already hunt animals and skin, and skin them and sell them as a trader. So why am I going to turn in different skins or different research to some lunatic in the woods when I get more money from giving my legendary pelts to my camp and selling them on a delivery. For lack of a better term, the game is supposed to write itself and it doesn't. Think about any Wild West type scenario where you wanna be able to go to a town and have a random shootout with people, but instead you can't actually do that. Yeah, you can start griefing another player or you can have a shootout with the cops, but there's just no content there. There's no actual feedback loop for what you're doing. And to juxtapose that, things like Outlaw camps that were present in the first Red Dead Online are so sparse and few and far between. You can literally walk around the entire map and never run into any outpost or bandit camp. They should just let us know where they are at all time and give it instance-based combat. And as I bring myself to that next point, why on God's green earth is there no survival mode for this game yet? As I look to a game like Grand Theft Auto Online compared to Red Dead Online, it's easy to understand as who's the favorite child and who's the bastard. Essentially in Grand Theft Auto Online, you're drinking from a damn fire hose with the amount of stuff that comes out and the poor Red Dead people are left just kind of sipping up the puddle. I think the biggest thing that Grand Theft Auto has is essentially its mission structure. You can jump into Grand Theft Auto Online and just let me just do whatever I want. And there's so many jobs to do. You could just say, play random mission, here I go, queue up, and the next thing you know, you're selling cocaine. But when you look at Red Dead Online, it doesn't even have anywhere close to that feature. Red Dead Online gives you eight missions to play in the online, plus the stupid bootlegger stuff that no one really gives a crap about. And I'm pretty sure that if you replay these missions, you don't even get experience, let alone any type of money to help you out with this. You're just wasting ammo. And like I said before, the gameplay and story should write itself in this world. Just give us a way to just queue up for a bunch of random missions and then just take all your outposts 
and structures that are already present in Red Dead Online and populate them with NPCs and just say, oh, whatever player, just go there and assassinate these things. It just blows my mind that stuff like this isn't even in the game. And I don't even want to get off on a different tangent and talk about things like downloadable content for like Undead Nightmare or Let Us Fight Vampires or, or anything. I just want the core gameplay to be so much more than what it is rather than this lackluster go to town to town collecting bounties picking damn dandelions and selling animal skins ultimately if red dead only focuses on the route of waiting for different roles to come to the game to add content it's going to just completely fail and fade out of existence and grand theft auto online will be here for the next three generations because that's their money maker. So to all those people currently not playing Red Dead Online because the most recent patch decided to completely break the game, what do you guys think? What else do you want in here? And I don't want to hear stupid ideas like, you should let us play the banjo in our camp because that's not real gameplay. I don't care about playing the banjo in my camp. We can have all that stuff once the main gameplay is back to being fun and there's content that I could do and when I want to just essentially do fuck all, I'll go to my camp and play the banjo. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for stopping by. I'm Rob from Downloadable Content, and I will see you in the next video.